Hello everyone. In this episode, we will learn how to hide a column in Power BI for the table visual. Let me switch to the computer for the demo. So from Power BI desktop, I will add a table visual first. So let me increase the height and reduce the width of the table. And from data model, I will add a business segment, then category and color column and sum of order quantity. So as you can see, I have added business segment, category, color, and sum of order quantity column. Now here I want to hide a color column. To how to do this? So first thing I will go to the data modeling and from data modeling, I will click on new parameter and from new parameter, I will click on fields. And here I will say, PAR parameter table visual. My parameter name. Okay. From data table, I will add a business segment as a parameter, category as a parameter, and color as a parameter. So I don't want any slicer to be added. So I'll remove this. And after that, I will click on create button. So now you can see in your data model, there is one table is added with the para table visual and single column, para table visual. The table name and the column name is same. So now I will add a one more table visual here to just show you the comparison. And from this table and from parameter table visual, I will add this column to table. So now you can see the business segment, category and color column. And from sales data table, I will add sum of order quantity. So now both the table are identical. Okay, so both the table has a same columns. Now I want to hide color column from here. So I'll select this visual and go to filter option. And in filter option, again, I will add a para table visual here. And from here, I will select all and I will remove a color column and I will just close everything. And now you can see color column is disappear from this visual. But that's all for this video. Thank you for watching. I kindly request you to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already and please like and share our content. You can also show your support by clicking the thanks button below the video. Thank you.